name is Brittany Fox. I'm 19 years young and I have dissociative identity disorder. I went through a long time when I had absolutely no idea who I was. But then I realized that I'm in control of how I see myself. And I realized I do know who I am. I can tell you what my favorite meal is, what my favorite color is. I know my dreams and I know what my passions are. I know who and what gives me inspiration. I know that I am very different and I'm okay with that. I know you have to go through a hell of a lot to get to where I am. Along with dissociative identity disorder, I've been diagnosed with depression, complex PTSD, social anxiety, along with borderline personality. Aside from my mental illnesses, I have a long list of medical conditions. I like to believe I'm more than just a mental illness. There has been a lot of things that have happened in my life to lead to where I am today. And I will open up and express them when the time is right. This is what I live with. This is my story. Doing this, I am making myself extremely vulnerable. I see this coming out in either one or two ways. One, I'm either gonna come out stronger with a lot of support or I'm gonna come out stronger knowing who is worth having in my life and who is not. For those who don't know what dissociative identity disorder is, or previously known as multiple personalities, everything in life triggers reaction. And when one is triggered a certain way, negatively, repeatedly, you can be driven to the point you no longer know how to cope with this life experience or this situation. DID is a coping method. So when you are triggered a certain way too many times, you can develop alters or others. And these alters can be two or more distinct personalities that rule one body. One body, multiple minds. Each alter perceives and interacts with the world differently. DID usually branches off of post-traumatic stress disorder or childhood trauma. With this, you will be able to grow with me, learn my story, learn my alters, get an inside look of my life. I'm a simple girl with just a really complicated mind. That's all it is. These videos will mostly be myself, Brittany. It'll be my opinions, my perception of the world. All right, introducing the alters. To this date, I have five. I have Michael Flettis. He's 58 years old and he's known as my protector. His trigger is if I'm in danger or an extreme amount of pain. Next I have Shania. She's 16 years old. And she's like rebellion. She's very seductive and very, very sure of herself. Her trigger is usually flashbacks to earlier on in my childhood. Next I have Mac. He's also 16. His trigger is trust and honesty. He's an artist. Next I have Ollie. Her trigger is abandonment or when I feel like I'm being dismissed. She's 13 and she's really innocent. She's happy. Next I have Bronte. Bronte, she's 20 and she comes out usually in a state of depression and I'm... <clears throat> so basically how we work together as a unit, we have journals. We all have separate ones as well as we, we share one. What comes with DID is memory loss, which cannot be explained as like ordinary forgetfulness. When an altar takes over, it becomes pretty much like a time lapse. You have no memory, you have no control over what happens. What my altars have done is keep journals. So me as the core mind, body, person thing, I'm not completely left out of my own life. They write about themselves. This is pretty much my own coming out story. Of course, I don't actually know how many people know about my DID, but this is me coming out as Brittany, talking about myself and my life, and I want to get my story known, as well as maybe I can help somebody else understand themselves. It took years to get people to listen to me. Finally, I got transferred to a psychologist who specializes in DID, told him my story, and he knew right away. I don't know how regularly I will be able to post videos. Along with this channel, I will be opening up a Twitter and ask 
and a Tumblr. So I can be reached. I will definitely keep you guys updated. Thank you. Mwah.